as a Christian, understand this. You are not, as it says up here, you're not sinless, but you will sin less. You will mess up. You will fall. Might not be robbing a bank, but you will blow it. Every one of us. Some of us sin on the front porch. Some of us sin on the back porch, but we all sin. Some of us more noticeable to others. Some of us less. People get saved. They're no longer called sinners. They're called saints. To the saints in Corinth, to the saints in Colossae, you are now a practicing saint that happens to sin. If I went to uh, Minnesota over the winter and I stayed there for the weekend and I played hockey, I couldn't come back now and then tell you year after year I'm a hockey player. It's not something I practice. It's something I happen to do for a short period of time. Do sinners, do, do godly people, do Christians, do saints sin? Yes. From King David committing adultery, godly people commit all kinds of sin. But the fact of the matter is they don't live there. 